Alright everyone, what's going on? It's Warhead Inc. here and welcome back to another Pokemon Yellow walkthrough. Um, we just got done through the whole tutorial, going through everywhere and talking to Professor Oak, doing his thing for him, delivering his package. Finally we're in Verinan Forest, I think it is. Oh, it doesn't show here. But yeah, we're in Verinan Forest, uh, where all the grass types are, and we have a new Pokemon on our team, a Netaran. Um, it's kind of beaten up right now, but last time my Pokemon Pikachu was like a low level than 11 is, and P and um, Pidgey was not 11 also, but yeah. Alright, the only things that I have done on here is actually beaten the trainers, all of them on here, so you won't see them, I think. Oh wait, I didn't beat this one, oops. But um, the rest of them I have beaten. The only thing I haven't done is gotten the stuff for everything, so I'm going to go back and do those. What I'm going to do is speed through this. Hopefully it doesn't mess up the audio and all that stuff very too much, but we'll see. That was all it that she did have. Nope. There we go. Alright, hopefully everything is still fine. My my stuff on here. This is what I'm going to be mostly doing, probably, most of the time. So, who knows. Uh, Nanoran can go ahead and take him. So, we're going to go ahead and speed this up, too. There you go. Alright. Caterpie... I better not risk it. found a new we found another pokeball now I can't speed up and walk at the same time because I'll just go flying across the map so I don't want that to really happen does it have anything in here nope I thought it did all right I already beat this trainer as you see he did not even try to attack me this time I already beaten him we're gonna go walk through them got that guy already here's a pokeball or an item, basically, that you could find. I don't know why they have it as Pokeballs on here, but who knows? They'd probably just be like, oh, they ran out of ideas how to make an item appear. So, I don't know. Alright, learn Scratch. So far, what, um, what I'm going to do is probably get this Pokemon to level 11-2, uh, my Nidoran. That's what I'm thinking about trying to do. Well, that's what I'm aiming at. So, hopefully we can get it around 11. But first I gotta get out of this forest. And another Caterpie. Actually, I do need a Caterpie on my team. Because it's a grass type, and then I have to rank it up. You know, everything else. So, this one I'm not gonna do too fast. But, hopefully enough it's... Alright, yeah. He's only doing two damage for me. And this should be in red. Yep. Alright. Now we're going to use our Pokeball. Oops. No. I want to use our Pokeball. There we go. Caught a Caterpie. It's a worm. I always knew that. Nope. Don't want to give it a nickname. Now I would put my Caterpie up front, but right now I'm not level grinding. But, oh, so now I was going to change it. But I do want to get it ranked up anyways. Also, there is a Metapod in here, too, and I don't I don't really remember the evolution of how it all comes about. So, I might even catch a Metapod. Who knows? Who knows? I, I have to check if Metapod is female or male. I know if it's... No, actually, a Weedle, if it does, it'll be a Con... I forgot what it was. It, was, it started with K. So, no, never mind. Even if I had a Caterpie... And I'm mean, even if I had a Metapod, it will still evolve into a Butterfree. I think that's right. I'm not very sure. Like I said, it's been so many years since I played this last. So let's go ahead. Ah, I found another potion. All right, that's all the stuff for us in here right now. I think there's also something hidden in the grass, but right now I'm not even gonna go check it. I just want to go to a Pokemon Center and get my Pokemon all healed up. But first, we're gonna switch out Pikachu and. Yeah, switch out Pikachu on them. Actually, Pikachu's well enough. 
because he's the top level, so I'm just going to switch to this, and I want to switch these two out. Alright, there we go. Alright, let's keep going. Trainer's tip. If you want to go fast, stay away from the grassy area. No, shh. Hold on, I'm going to skip this because I pressed it again. Alright, there we go. Uh, these guys don't give you anything, and uh, yeah, there goes a the tall grass. I'm not even going to do anything in tall grass, like I said before. I'm not going to be level grinding very much on the whenever it's live like this and everything. I'm not going to jump cut it either. I think that I'm going to keep everything in. I'm just going to speed through it instead, but who knows? Most, it's going to be, my speed through is basically going to be, uh, uh, most battles. Alright. I don't think anyone gives you anything here, but it's always good to search around the town to see what people will give you and what people won't give you. Trying to learn new techniques, some will be taught by trainers. Pokemon become easier to catch when it hurt or sleep. But it's not a sure thing. All right. I know Pikachu is doing a lot more. Uh, I think he's more friendlier. Psst. Do you know what I'm doing? Yes, I do. That's right. It's hard work. I think he's just walking around. But yeah, we're in Peter City, where the first gym battle will be at for Brock. Now I don't remember the rest of them, but I will eventually. Notice, thieves have been stealing Pokemon fossils at Mount Moon. Please call Pierce City Police with any info. Alright, well I don't have any info of it since I just started out my own adventure here. Let her in sit. Alright. Our Pokemon's an outsider, so it's hard to handle. An outsider is a Pokemon that you get in trade. It grows fast, but it may ignore an unskilled trainer in battle. Okay, if only we had some badges. Well, you are in a town that has Boulder Badge on here. I think it was Rock Badge or Boulder Badge, one of the two. You can basically go fight him right now, but you're not. You're sitting there and just, you know, whatever you're doing. Alright, nothing interesting. Alright, this is the gym here. Now, I could just go ahead and go in the gym and be like, oh yeah, this and that. But I'm not. I'm not just yet. I don't think I'm ready. I don't think there's a way in. Oh, there is a way in. You have to use cut. Okay. I know all the stuff around here. Um. Alright, no, there's nothing here. Alright. My first gym. And I'm already, uh. I'm very high. Like, yeah, I can go ahead and do it. But, let's go ahead. Alright. One. Stop right there, kid. You're still light years from facing Brock. Like I said, he is not a very important trainer, so... Let's try Caterpie. Oh, no. Oh, well. No, I, I need to level it up, so let's do this. There we go. Sandshrew. Yes. Uh, let's go to Caterpie again, because he needs to level up. Oh, I don't want to attack. Oh, he fainted. Oh, well. Quick attack. There we go. Alright, there we go. Darn. Light years isn't time. It's measured distance. That's kind of... Yeah, that's kind of a way to look at it. Now we're going to go back to the Pokemon Center to actually go heal up my Pokemon. Um, that has fainted. So, only thing I'm going to be doing is mostly with Brock. I'm going to be switching out Pokemon so I can actually level grind them up. Because that's what I like to do. Yeah, let's go ahead and speed this up. There we go. So... What I'm thinking about doing is actually having Caterpie up front, again, and we're just gonna fly by him. Like crazy with Pidgey. I have, po I have potions, so it's a lot better to, since I have potions. Um, always in every game that I actually experience is save before anything. There we go. That's a lot faster. Alright, let's go ahead. I'm Brock. I'm Peter's gym leader. 
I believe in rock hard defense and determination. It's my it's why my Pokemon are all rock type. Do you still want to challenge me? Fine then. Show me what you're best. Like the song. Alright, Brock wants to fight. He will send out his Geodude. His Geodude is a level 10. Now I know dang well he ain't gonna be able to handle him, so we're gonna go ahead and switch automatically. If I have to go to my Pikachu, I will be um, I will be doing a lot of uh, quick attacks. Alright, Gus. Let's see how bad, how good it would do. Nope, it didn't do that much. Well, we're gonna be sitting here for a while. Unless... I, I probably should have did that and got him some uh, some stuff for him, but I don't know. I'm gonna try it one more time. Nope, still not effective. And he doesn't drop me. I'm so glad. I'm actually surprised he didn't drop me. I'm gonna use a potion right quick. Get my stuff back up. Alright. Alright, I'm gonna use stand attack and make sure his, uh, make fall, uh, hit, make his agility fall down and his accuracy. Most likely I think it was accuracy only, so. So he'll miss every time. See, now he's starting to miss. I'm gonna keep dropping him for a little bit more. Hopefully he won't attack me, but he just did. Um, maybe one more. We'll see if he'll miss. Yep, he missed. Okay. What I'm going to do is. Nah, let's not. Let's just keep going with Pidgey. Eventually, he's going to keep hitting him over and over. And he's going to drop his accuracy. Uh, his accuracy is already dropped enough, and he's not going to hit me anymore. Let's go ahead and switch out of Pikachu, actually. Let's see how uh, Pikachu would do. I'll just keep using Quick Attack. Well, I got 30 of it, too. Uh, Pikachu's not doing that much, but it was critical, at least. Uh, let's drop his defense. Now, normally I don't really use Tail Whip or and all that stuff, so normally I just keep on attacking over and over. But if I keep dropping his defense, eventually maybe I'll be able to just go ahead and do more damage. I hope he attacked me once. I should do more damage now, probably. Yeah, see? There it goes. It's dropping him. Very quick-like, but not too much, but it's enough to drop him to the yellow and the red. And there. Uh, Go. And I think two more attacks should actually kill him. I'm not very sure. We're gonna have to see. Yep, there goes one. See, Geodude could not attack me at all. If Geodude was attacking me, my whole Pokemon had been wiped. But since not, we're gonna have to get these up here. Alright. Oh, he learned Quick Attack also, so now I can use Pidgey for a Quick Attack. Onyx. And yes, I do want to switch. What we're gonna do is Caterpie again. I think I'm a full on attack Caterpie, but I'm not very sure. Uh, he doesn't have any grass types, so it's gonna hurt him too. Um, I'm gonna need to heal him, so we're gonna go to Nanoran, we're gonna heal up my Pidgey, and then we're gonna go ahead and use Pikachu to knock him down too. Uh, let's use some Growl. Vine is a little different though, whenever you play the newer versions, I think, so I'm not very sure. Alright, his attack fell. He's just letting me go right at it. There we go, he unleashed it, but he missed his attack. I'm trying to drop his attack and all his stuff basically the best I can, so all I have to do is go ahead and attack him. I'm just gonna keep using the smallest. Uh oh. Okay, I can't move. Now, this is the one thing they actually changed is that, um, they actually changed that up so you can actually move them. Uh, move better in the later versions. Alright, let's drop his attack again. Drop it one more time. I want to drop it enough that he can't hardly attack me. Like, my my defense is higher than his and he won't be able to hit me. Oh, okay. It did nothing. Which means is that he is fully down. And let's go ahead and heal up our Pidgey. Because we're going to need him and Pikachu. Either we're going to use one or the other, you know. Alright. I'm going to switch over to Pidgey. Alright, Pidgey, drop him a little bit. 
his accuracy. So now his attack in accuracy is going down, but he'll just keep missing. Um, he dropped my defense down. That's alright. You can drop my defense down. It's not going to really do very much. He's just going to keep using the same moves. I think he has attack, bind, um, the other move they just used. I'm not very sure what that was. Unleashed it. Nope. Didn't work. Yeah, bid. Okay, bid and bind. And I think his other attack... I'm not very sure where his last attack is. At least he only has three attacks. Alright, it did nothing. Now I can go ahead and keep hitting him. Maybe it'll do some damage. No, it didn't do that much damage. Oh, you know what? I know who I can do damage with. P Pikachu. What I'm gonna do is drop his um his defense. I mean, most of his attack is not working anymore, so we're not gonna really worry about it. See, he can't hardly beat me up. He's actually pretty low. I'm surprised actually it allowed me to keep um, doing it to Onyx. Who knows? Maybe it's just luck right now. It's a good night, probably. Who knows? But it could be. I'm gonna keep dropping him until I can't do anything anymore. And then I can strike. Yeah, okay, we're good. See, he's gonna be missing a lot of stuff now because he can't attack me. He can't. His attack fell, his defense fell, and his accuracy fell. And attack and the accuracy is the one key thing that should hit me a lot. Since mine's doing a lot better than him, I'm just doing work. Hopefully he'll go down. Oh well, I was just about to say, I hope he goes down to yellow, but we're gonna have to drop him big time in red. Maybe I can hit a critical. Nope. Let's try again. And this should drop him to red. Nope. Alright. So it's gonna be like three, four attacks now. Probably three, four. I'm counting three. That's one. Nope. That's probably two attacks. Two. Oh, it was two attacks. Okay. That should give you a big boost to Canopy. Probably he'll be... Nope. Everyone's ranking up today. Nope. Not even Pidgey or Pikachu. Okay. And I beat Brock. I took you for granted. As proof of your victory, here's the Boulder Badge. Yay, I received the Boulder Badge. So yes, we have beat um, Brock. Oh, that's an official Poker League badge. It's... Burr? Pokemons become more powerful. The technique Flash can be used anywhere now. At any time. Oh, Caterpie is evolving. Cool. To Metapod. Let's speed this up. There you go. Wait, take this with you. The only thing I didn't like about the Pokemon series is that, I mean, Pokemon series in the game, in the game, Brock doesn't come with you, he stays here. I mean, no one else is going to be coming by here, so why in the world would he stay here? That's what I didn't understand. I don't want to talk to you again. And that's why I was like, oh, okay. Well, Misty is water type. In test your Okay, hold on. Thank you. Alright, like I was saying, Misty is a water type, and she comes with you too. But for some reason... No one comes with you at all during your Pokemon journey. So I was like, okay, that's pretty weird, I guess, in a certain way, as you can say. And now the guy's gone, because he's blocking me from here. Alright. From this part, we are going to go ahead and stop recording right quick. I hope that you guys liked the video. If you guys did, make sure to leave a like, favorite, comment, and also subscribe so you can see more videos that are coming out very, very soon. Well, that's it for now. I will catch you guys later.